I know you're gonna dig this. Now, here's a little story I got to tell. Now, you're wondering how come this podcast is late. I was giving you time to get the last one straight. LeBron James just can't get right. I mean, when he got out of Cleveland and went to Los Angeles, he left behind J.R. Smith, whose lack of game awareness cost the Cavs game one of the NBA Finals. The Cavs ended up losing the series to the Golden State Warriors. And more on Golden State in a minute, but more on LeBron right now because he just can't get right. Because while he left J.R. Smith in Cleveland, he inherited Lance Stevenson when he joined the Lakers. It's like LeBron left a slight headache and caught a migraine. Y'all know how Lance can be. Then again, the way this is looking, LeBron needs all the help he can get just trying to fill out a solid lineup because Paul George had a shot to wait on LeBron to choose his landing spot in free agency. But Paul George said, I'm good, and stayed in Oklahoma City. Chris Paul could have gotten with LeBron, but was like, uh, I'm straight, and stayed with Houston. LeBron, as the NBA's version of the Man of Steel, used to be viewed as a player magnet. Now it's like he's made out of kryptonite to the NBA's supermen, the superstars. I mean, at a time when players we've never heard of are getting major money, four-time NBA All-Star DeMarcus Cousins agreed to accept relative peanuts to play with Steph Curry and the Golden State Warriors. No, no, no! And even if it's true that the Lakers passed up an opportunity to get Cousins, it's like I said, LeBron just can't get right. And Golden State... Man, they just ain't doing right. They're not playing fair. Coming off back-to-back -back NBA titles. Squad already stacked now. And then they got Boogie. For more sports or entertainment, hard news, health news, you name it, go to urbanmediatoday.com. That's urbanmediatoday.com. Keeping you connected from the fields to the stands. I'm your man, John McKeon. Thank you.